Hey, I'm Owen. Welcome to Femora 101 series. I'm going to spend time with you, walk you through the program so that you have everything you need to get started. Let's begin by opening up the software. On the opening screen, you'll be given a couple of choices. The first choice is what dimension you want your video to be in. Standard, 4x3 or widescreen, 16x9. Most users will choose 16x9. This is what the majority of Android, Apple devices, as well as DSLRs record in. Secondly, you can choose to create your video in easy mode or full feature mode. Easy mode is a great way to create videos in three steps, with our ready to use themes. In this video, I will walk you through the full feature mode. When you first open the full feature mode, you'll notice there's three sections that make up the interface. The main navigation, the timeline, and the video playback. Let's start with the media in the main navigation. This is where you import your media files for your project so you can organize as you wish. Secondly, we have a number of menu items that will help spice up your videos, including music, title, filters, overlays, elements, transitions, and split screen. We'll explore all of these options in a future video. This part in the bottom of the interface is what we call a timeline. You can activate your timeline simply by dragging and dropping any media file to this module. Once it's there, you can make basic adjustments to your media. You can also split your clips so that you will have the scenes you need. The last part of the interface is your video preview screen. This is where you'll be able to review all the changes and features you've implemented. For more resources, you can click the menu button in the upper right corner or to save and open a recent project, you can simply click on the Filmora logo in the upper left corner. When your movie is all done, click the export button to share, save, or export your final project. Well, that's the end of our tutorial. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I'll see you next time.